Hi guys, this is uh, my review of the Thermos Ultimate Series flask. I stumbled across this flask quite by accident when I was doing, looking at some reviews on Amazon and it just seemed to have the best reviews of all any flask out there. I was a bit sick and tired of my old metal flask. It had broken on me, it weighed a ton, I thought it was time for an upgrade. I went with this, I haven't been disappointed. I've taken it out many times now, I have not been disappointed. It's a great flask. It comes in a 900ml and a 500ml version. This is the 900 the advertising claims on it are quite bold. They will say that it will keep things hot or cold for 24 hours. I didn't believe them, so I had to do a little test. I made some tea, and to be fair to it, 18 hours later when I came back from work the next day, it was still steaming when it came out. So it really does work. The insulation is fantastic on this thing. It keeps things hot in the winter, cold in the summer, just what you need. The key, as always with any flask, is pre-warming. So put a little boiling water in there, swill it around, shut up the flask, leave it for five minutes to sit. That warms the metal so that, it, that metal is not going to suck heat from whatever drink you put in there. So pre-warm it, tip out that water, put in your tea or coffee, do the lid up, away you go. The flask itself is stainless steel. It's wrapped in kind of a lightweight plastic coating. It feels very, very light and it only weighs 390 grams for the 900 milliliter version, obviously less for the 500. Um, the silicon rings around it protect the flask from falls when it knocks over and the bumpers at the bottom are great. The best thing, best feature of this I think is the pouring spout. The pouring spout itself has two, two parts. You've got an inner stopper and you just need to turn that a little bit, just enough, and you can pour out some liquid through that. And it, what it does is it doesn't expose too much of the inner flask to the cold air. So you're just letting your drink out and then you can seal it back up and that helps keep it warm for a long time. If you're having multiple tea stops, that's quite beneficial. Then you can take the inner ring out as well, which makes the neck a lot wider. And with that, you can, you can obviously fit in bigger things like um, chunky soups, wouldn't fit down the neck normally. Once you seal it all back up, put the stopper back in, that unit is good to go. Your drink is going to stay hot. The other thing I love about it is the cup. A lot of cups, they kind of teeter on this kind of rounded base and they fall over all the time when you put them down on a rocky surface or a smooth surface. This one's great. It's kind of a rubberized coating. It's got little feet that kind of splay out on it and it will sit flat on most surfaces. It won't slide. And the flask itself doesn't roll massively either. It'll stand on either end. It's really well designed. I can't rave enough about this flask. And I've taken it out many times on bike rides and walks. It's 900 milliliters. It's enough tea for two, three, four people at a push, which is exactly what you need in this time of year, in the autumn and the winter. Great for little ones. They like a nice warming drink. Ultimate insulation is what it says. And honestly, it is fantastic. It's far better than the cheap flasks you can buy out there. This really is the best of the best. And so I highly recommend it. If you go to the link below, it'll take you through to the blog and you can link through to the product from there and there'll be a bit more of a description on the blog itself. So thanks for listening. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.